Hi oh guys, Matt from 123MyOT here. In this video, I will show you my top five Android settings that you should turn off in 2022. Guys, I'm gonna show you some Android settings that you should turn off straight away. These settings are designed to take the load off your phone's CPU, which will speed up your phone and save battery life. It will also help you increase the privacy on your phone. Let's get started. Today I'm using a Samsung phone, but if you're on a different phone, it might look a little bit different, but the settings will be the same. The first thing to turn off is nearby device scanning, and you can find it under settings, connections, and more connection settings. This sets your phone to scan for nearby devices. This is constantly running, so you should turn it off and you will save battery power. Next, you can turn off usage and diagnostic settings. This is information that is being sent to Google or developers when you're not using your phone and it chews up battery life. To find it, go to settings, Google, and tap the three dots in the top right hand corner and then tap usage and diagnostics. Just toggle the button off and this will save you battery life and cellular data. It's a win-win situation. Next setting to turn off is ads personalization and you can find it under settings, Google and then ads. This is a funny one. Have you ever been talking about something and then all of a sudden that ad starts popping up on your phone? This data is collected and sent to ad networks so they can send you more relevant ads. It's too creepy in my opinion. To turn it off, you actually need to turn this one on to opt out. And just go ahead and tap OK. Next we will talk about turning off improved accuracy with Wi-Fi and Bluetooth scanning and you will find it under settings, location, and tap improve accuracy. If you turn these two settings off, you will save a ton of battery life. So toggle the Wi-Fi and the Bluetooth buttons off. Awesome, now your phone will not be constantly scanning and your GPS will still work, so no problems there. The next one is Google location history, and you will find it under settings, location, and Google location history. This lists all the locations you've been to. It's similar to iPhone significant locations where it just saves a long list of all the places you've been. It's a bit weird in a tracking sense. So just go ahead and turn it off at the bottom and then you're done. Guys, don't forget to check out my other videos such as how to forward calls on Android in 2022. And do me a favor, if you know anyone who might like this video, please share it with them. Hit the subscribe button, smash the bell icon.